Master Father back in the kitchen one more time with your dishes, guys. Lovely dishes and amazing dishes, drinks, food, everything, you name it. And you also can claim it. Remember, Christmas is coming up very soon and we got a lot of recipe for Christmas. We start to put out some Christmas tips already and there's more to come. Enjoy the recipe, subscribe to the channel and remember to get a copy of my cooking book online from Amazon and it's the best price ever in this world. We love you. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Nice and lovely guys. Welcome back. Welcome back. We want to make you a nice, lovely Christmas perfect Yasha pudding at home in your kitchen. Anyway, we're going to use some virgin oil. This is olive oil, the best in the world. Basically, we're going to use two, three, six, nine, twelve. So first of all, what you need to do, preheat the oven first. That's one of the main things you need to do, guys. Preheat the oven and a high temperature gas mark eight is really good for it. So what we're going to do is pop a little bit of the olive oil inside of here, inside of here, inside right here also roughly a tablespoon of the virgin oil yeah nice one so as you can see beautiful christmas really nice is a roast and also we're gonna put some yasha pudding this christmas on the table so guys you're gonna love it you're gonna enjoy the recipe and i'm telling you Basically, you're gonna put this straight inside of your oven and get it hot and ready for your sweet, nice yasha pudding. I know you guys are gonna love this one. I'm excited, you know what I mean? Because in you know, a long time I don't make yasha pudding, and I say I wanna give the fans and for them to enjoy the recipe. So, first of all, preheat the oven, gas mark eight or nine is good. Or uh, if you're using a different kind of oven, 175 is good, or 180. This one, which I'm gonna use right here, is perfect, guys. As you can see, 6.5 centimeter beautiful enjoy the recipe let's put it inside of the oven Shh, don't tell anyone anything we're gonna put it in the oven now and get them hot hot be careful health and safety use oven gloves nice and lovely so right here this is where we're gonna make the perfect yasha pudding for christmas all right look at this guys first of all put this at the side this is one cup yeah, if you've got a small cup at your house, you can use it. Look at the measurement which we're gonna do for your Yasha pudding. So first of all, you need to get one cup of plain flour or our purpose flour. I don't know what to call it at your house, but basically in England, we call it all purpose flour or plain flour in Jamaica. Sieve it, that's one of the most important thing that when you're making your Yosha pudding, you get it sieved like this and it came out really perfect, light, nice and really beautiful guys and I know you guys will love the recipe and I know you guys will enjoy the recipe and also, if you like the recipe, one thing, please leave your comments, subscribe to the channel and also leave a comment it is very important for chef ricotta with the comments all right then next thing we're gonna do i'm gonna use some owner milk but before we put the owner milk let's put a pinch of pepper and also a pinch of salt lovely and nice simple ah this is beautiful guys look at that beautiful beautiful the next thing what you're gonna do simple fold your cup with some milk inside of it really nice put that at the side really nice then after you fold your cup with milk simple that's the cup same way no shot because it's a very simple recipe all you need to do Get some egg, crack the egg and put it straight inside of it like that. You're gonna fold it with some eggs, all right? Ah, nice one. That's two egg. Ah, that's three egg. Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't tell me, three small and that's four egg. Whoa, 
that's four egg lovely nice so as you can see guys four egg makes one cup all right nice one then simple put this at the side lovely and nice then what you're gonna do add your milk to your mixture like this ah look at this guys this is beautiful Ah, oh, man, this, this, yasha pudding, yasha pudding, yasha pudding. Beautiful. Lovely. Put this at the side, get this one, and put the egg straight inside of it like this. Beautiful, really nice. Just look at that. Then, what we're gonna, what we're gonna do next now is simple. Beat the egg, beat it, beat it, beat it, beat it. Lovely. Beat some more. Nice one. Look at that. Really nice. Rich and nice. And that's what you're looking for. Put up this at the side. Then take your time and pour in the egg. Lovely. Ah, oh, man. This is a proper Yorkshire pudding. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Beautiful. Put in the rest of the egg inside of it. Oh man, this is beautiful. What I would do is simple. Put just a pinch more flour, not too much. Just a little pinch more flour. So we're gonna sieve roughly, just a, little, a pinch more flour inside of it, just to get the body right. Cause you don't wanna be too. You have to be careful with the body. All right. Ah. Oh. That's perfect. That is perfect, guys. I love that. I love, I love the look of this so far. Then what I'm gonna simply do, um, basically, we're gonna simple get the the inside of this clean out. Lovely. Then we, the mixture is ready. Pour it in. Straight inside of it like this. Straight inside. Don't leave any of this Yasha pudding, guys. This is Yasha pudding. This is Yasha pudding. Don't leave any inside of it. We need everything. Lovely. The next thing what you're gonna do, you're gonna get your oven. You're gonna get you're gonna take out your pan from the oven. Remember, it's really, really hot, guys. So you have to be careful, all right? Be careful when you take it from the oven and I don't want you to get burned. So let's take it from the oven. Nice. And just take it from the oven, very hot. Be careful. Now we're gonna pour in our Yasha pudding mixture inside of it like this, guys, because I want you guys to see. And we are gonna make in 12 Yasha pudding. All right? Lovely and nice. Look at that. Beautiful. Ah, that is fantastic, guys. Woo! Man, this is fabulous. I love this. I love this, guys. I love this. Ah, this is fantastic. This is fun. Seriously. Seriously. This is beautiful. So. That is finished. We're gonna put it back straight quickly in the side of the oven, quick and done and dusted. Remember, gas mark seven or eight is good if you're using a different oven, 165 or 180 is good for 25 minutes inside of the oven, guys. Quickly, 25 minutes, done and dusted.
it and just take them from the oven guys just look at us beautiful you should put it all made fresh and lovely guys hopefully you will enjoy the recipe subscribe to the channel and leave your comments thank you so much for watching chef for the cooking program we got a lot more recipe like this coming up for you so enjoy the recipe and it's a perfect Yasha pudding from Chef Ricardo. See you next time. Bye. Nice. Guys, as I can see, all the Yasha pudding them look beautiful. Look at this. Really nice and beautiful, guys. Hopefully, you will enjoy the recipe. And subscribe to the YouTube channel. Thank you so much for watching Chef Ricardo Cooking Program. We've got a lot more recipe like this coming out for you. But look at this. Beautiful. Really nice. Enjoy the recipe. Subscribe to the channel and leave your comments. Hopefully we can come up with a lot more recipe like this for you guys. Beautiful Yasha Puri recipe. Perfect. Facebook and Twitter, Instagram, and also Google Plus. So, guys, follow me and get more ideas. Don't miss out anything. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Thank you for your time. And remember, Christmas, we have a lot of ideas. Remember the Jamaican rum food cake and sorry. So, a lot of things is coming for you guys. So thank you so much, and hopefully, you have a wonderful time. Enjoy yourself and see you in the next time. Bye bye.